Well, folks, we're heading on up to the barn. Um, I got to move the hot spot chicken coop. And I'm not sure if I'll need the tractor. Sometimes the ATV doesn't want to start. And um, if that's the case, I'll just disconnect it and use the tractor to move it. But really beautiful morning this morning. It was 51 degrees when I got up at 6 o'clock. And um, it's only warmed up a few degrees. But the skies are clear. And um, the sun's coming out, so it's going to warm up. So our first few days with the hot spot has, has gone well. The goats have gotten a full three days out of it and probably could go another day, but I thought it would be best to just get them onto something fresh. And that's what we're gonna do this morning. Good morning, YouTube. Mm. It's 8 a.m., 55 degrees. I'm up here in the pasture, um, and I got to move the goat hotspot in the electric fence. So I thought I'd just bring you guys along and do a time lapse. And it's a beautiful morning, just a little bit chilly, but once I get moving here, I'll be all right. So let me get set up, and I'll get filming. So this is rather easy task. These stakes push in with the heel of your boot and they pull all the ground relatively easy if you move them within a few weeks. If you let them sit longer than that, they become hard to take out. But I'm just gonna lift up three sides of it and move that, leave the one side stationary. I've learned to not wear Crocs when doing this. It's best to have a legitimate pair of sneakers or a pair of rubber boots or something, a little thicker heel um, that tends to wear your leg muscles out pretty quick if you don't. But the whole process is, as you can see, is pretty fast. Took a little effort getting the ATV started this morning. It was cold and it didn't want to turn over. Okay, so I got that moved, and uh, I'm just gonna go get the coats. So I'll keep this going, and uh, I'll be right back.
so that's a wrap and I think the whole thing took me like a half hour so so I did I I just took a look back at the clock and it was just under 30 minutes and I wasn't hustling I was just doing it so it's not too bad what I did was I only moved three walls of the fence I left that one wall stationary and I think when I flip-flop it the next way, I'll do the same thing. I'll leave one wall stationary and just flip-flop three walls. It seems to make it a little faster. But the goats are happy. They got some new stuff. I'm happy. So that's the spot they were on. And you can see how it's pretty well eaten down. They left some long stuff. And then here's what they'll be working on today. So they've been in this area before, just on free grazing, but um, it's a good spot underneath the tree. So I think the chickens will be happy in the shade. They seem to be bothered by the sun more than the goats. You'll always find them doing dust bath and trying to cool down. But beautiful morning. Still undecided. I think I want to do these changes at night, like come up I could put the goats away early nah doing it in the mornings I guess the best but that's all folks I just wanted to show you the process and kind of give you an idea how long it took and what was entailed so hope you have a great day